One year after two men were murdered, police in Palm Bay are still looking for three unidentified suspects. And now for the first time, detectives are releasing video of who they think is responsible. As News 6's James Barbero reports, police are counting on the public to solve this case. One year ago on Katoro Road, we're locking the doors from now on. Scared neighbors hearing about two men killed inside this house. Terrible. This is a real nice neighborhood. Mike Prater lives next door. He says the house is now vacant. Last year, Palm Bay police say a woman lived here, and that morning she found her boyfriend and his friend both dead inside. She had came home from work and discovered her boyfriend, Chad Harris, along with his friend, Rashawn Brown, had been. Uh, murdered. Hopefully they'll figure this out quick. But police say they haven't. Marking a year now since the murders, police just gave us surveillance from the house. Detectives say three men with guns forced one of the victims in his car in the driveway to take them inside. Their motive? Robbery. There were some items taken from the home because the third suspect coming out of the house is seen carrying some items. Police say people were talking early on, but information they got did not lead to any arrests. A year later, police say more information has been hard to come by. Rashawn Brown worked in the pharmacy department at Walmart. His aunt talking to us today on the phone. Who did it? Why? Where are they? It's been very hard on our family. Well, somebody knows something out there. If you have information about this unsolved double homicide, you're asked to call Palm Bay Police. In Palm Bay, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.